Okay, <coughs> yet another unplanned, unexpected uh, Commander Lucosa Elite Dangerous video. This is getting to become a bit of a habit. But this one should have a fair bit of action in it. The reason being, if you've been watching or reading either the Elite Dangerous Facebook wall or the forums or even the news broadcasts within the game you will know that there is currently a battle going on at the Zera system and guess where I am Coney Port orbiting Zera 3 now there are two conflict zones actually I'm in more dock, there you go but there are two conflict zones there are also two checkpoints. I don't know what these checkpoints are. So I'm going to check out those, or one of the checkpoints first. I'll check out the nearest one first. And then we'll head to a conflict zone. So let's see how battle is done. This is going to be a test of the most frustrating aspect of the game throughout beta namely the uh, constant ramming by enemy ships in conflict zones and particularly around distress signal zones so let's see if it's been fixed I do have well, just over 3 million credits Get out of my way. So anyway, yeah, I do have over three million credits, so I will be able to uh, do a insurance claim if it's nice, you know, if it's necessary, which I suspect it will be. you never know. Now the checkpoint I think could be... Friendship charge detected. Uh, sort of, it could be set up by the Empire to find out whose side you are on. Friendship anyway, let's find out. down it's saying I'm not even doing two megameters per second and this thing's 189 light seconds away 13 hours away from it I've got to sort that out it didn't do that anywhere near as many times during the beta version now in the finished game it does it every time you fucking use super cruise So I've never seen one of these before, so I'm not sure what I have to do once I'm there. I'm not even sure what I'm going to see there. So it's possible I may have to leave in a hurry. It's also possible I may have to choose a faction. It 
say, it's all new to me. Well, this checkpoint is right above this uh, planet. This is a bit of a pain in the ass. check out that unidentified signal source but I can't be asked at the moment there's more important things once this checkpoint's done we don't want to head to the uh, conflict zones now, according to what I've read uh, the forces from the Empire have been sent there by Senator Petraeus and they are struggling so hopefully that means there will be plenty of targets for me to uh, check out. There are a lot of ships around here. coming up as system defence force. Now does that mean they are on my side or not? Well, I've no idea what any of that is going on about. You've already set the broadcast Well, what are my IDs? Actions are set at none. Uh, well, it don't look like there's much here, so let's go to the nearest conflict zone. Friendship drive charging. 131 light seconds away. Three, two, one, engage. So low intensity, but then both of them are low intensity, so. But I have a feeling that if I fight on the side of the Empire, which of course I will, I will then want to avoid those checkpoints. Especially as all of those pilots there were showing as elite, and there's me, mostly harmless. As always, I will have all four, well, four pips in weapons, two in systems, nothing in engines, so I will be slow. But I will have maximum firepower. I think my firepower is relatively okay. And I will also have... Uh, Well, my shields as best as I can with the maximum in weapons because my power distri distribution is is an A so it's not bad my power supply is only a C so that could be better but that's not really going to make much difference in terms of uh, Yeah, you know, how well the parts actually work. It looks like the conflict zone is in pretty close orbit of this planet, whichever planet it is, I can't see from it. Oh, there are done unidentified signal source there. That ship looks like it's approaching. I oh, see there is yeah, there's a port here. So that ship may be approaching the port rather than the conflict zone. In fact, that looks like that's exactly what it's doing. Now, I must admit I'm feeling a bit of trepidation here because I really don't want to have to, you know, lose close to 600,000 on a uh, insurance claim. But I have a feeling that is going to happen. Here we are. 
Yeah. Choose my faction. Oh, fucking hell. Well, I have no idea which one's which, so let's fight for these guys then. Oh shit. The first fucking uh, ship, I, ship I see is an anaconda. And it's the anaconda who's firing at me. He's buggered off now. Let's see what else is in the area. The Viper. Of course, it would also help if I deployed my weapons. that by someone else. I better get the kill for that, I did, okay. Whoa, someone else is firing. That one. Damn it. Cannons are proving to be a bit unreliable. And he was getting a bit too close for comfort there. Got someone else shooting at me. It's that anaconda again. I really do not want to be taking him on. My shields are getting low-ish. Nice. No, had his attention uh, caught there. Whoa, where's he going? He's coming straight at me again. Shields are online again. Cannons are nowhere near hitting him. There we go. Uh, he's launched the uh, chaff. Uh, he's getting low, but... Oh, he's also getting very close. His shields are going up again. I have a horrible feeling I'm not going to be able to get him before his shields are fully charged. Of course it doesn't help that we're just going round and round in fucking circles. There yeah, we go, shields back online. He's doing a runner. I might regret that. He's now turned round. And because I have no power to the engines, I'm not going to be able to do that again in a hurry. Shoot offline again. Count seven. Four. Come on, fucker. Two. Believe it, he's down to one. Where are you gone? If you fucking try and ram me, I'm gonna fucking go ballistic. Now he's launched fucking chaff again, he's gonna get his shields back up before I can hit him. close. I'm going very slow. 
slowly actually, I just realised that. Come on, you fucker. That's you done. state is that anaconda in? I'm going to regret this, but let's give it a go. I don't get any extra, I don't think, for destroying an anaconda. It's still just considered a regular enemy ship. So, in fact... Oh, the shields are offline now. Whoa. I didn't think he was that fucking close to me. Someone is getting very close to me there. That Viper is a friendly, but he's in my fucking way. If I can take out this anaconda, which is asking, well, I mean, look at this, I'm not even scratching him. I've just taken him down by 1%. Uh, bollocks to him. There's another ship around here, another enemy, who's relatively on his own. Okay, well, this fucker is only an eagle. I think he's having a bit of a laugh if he, uh... And I'm having a laugh trying to do this. There we go. Whoa! That's not an eagle. <laughs> Mind you, it's an anaconda with very weakened hull. friendly got in front and my cannon fire is not really doing a lot. That's the anaconda and he's down. And again I only got 3,000 for it but now what's that? That's an eagle. Okay, we'll give him a go. friendly, which is handy. Okay, we'll give this one a go. This is another eagle, but I can't see if he's going to be sit in front of him, or rather the friendly so in front of him or behind him. Okay, you will try taking me out, you're welcome to try. Do I get that? Yes. There are not many enemy ships left in this area. Another eagle. Right. Well, there's some of you. Now, I have no idea, as I say, if I'm fighting on the Empire side or not. Anaconda is getting in my way. That's you down. I guess there's one way of finding out, and that's to see what my reputation is with the uh, Empire at the moment. 
but it hasn't changed. Oh, that didn't tell me a fucking thing. Let's just go and kill some more people then, shall we? Oh, here's a viper. Oh, I've blown up enough of them in my time. Let's try and add one more to that. Oh, he's getting close. Because I was firing my cannon while he was still got his shields up. And the cannon fire against shields is not that good, at least not as far as I can remember. Now it will be okay. This is a system defence force, so if that's defending the system, I think therefore I am on the side of the Emperor. Fuck her out maneuvered the uh, cannon shot. Yeah, I'm on over that one as well. Get out of the way! Under attack. From who? Oh, okay, I can see. He's not doing anything though. Uh, this bloke is must be doing a runner. Let's go after him. Oh. Again, that looks like being a bit of a mistake. <laughs> that was too close. Got him down to below 40. I'm not the only one firing at him, I think. Yes, I am. I'm not doing much, because I'm right on the fucking limit of my range again. <sighs> Fucker. And now he's used the uh, chaff again. coming at me at such an angle that my cannon won't hit him. Now it might. Would if I... Uh, he's running again. This time I think he really is going to run. Because he's... closing up, but not by a lot, he's still running away. Oh, I'm not going to catch the fucking... He hasn't frame shifted away, he's just out of range. And an ass is never going to catch a viper. So let's go back. It's a bit of a waste of ammo. Speaking of uh, ammo, I'm very low on my cannon ammo. So I may have to get out of here pretty sharp. Now this guy's deadly. If I can do Mind you, he's running as well. about going up against those fucking things. Fucking little piss ain't a uh, thing. Come on then. He's not the one firing. Okay, he's now. He's 
going to move first. This is definitely going to be me. Oh. Who is this firing? That's an anaconda. I am not taking you on, pal. down to 16. Does that mean he's now going to try and fucking run? See you what, he's being a pain in the ass as far as manoeuvring around me. Here he is. Carl, that must be him down. Yes it is. Right, now where's that this other fucker who's firing? I think it was him. That's a python. Jesus Christ, I don't fancy taking one of those fuckers on. Oh, fuck it, go on then. I've taken these on before and blew one up and the other one did a runner, so... Speaking of doing a runner, that's exactly what this cunt's doing. His, because I'm not the only one shooting at him. Oh, he felt that one all right. Reloading. I can't have much ammo left. No, I don't have much ammo left. away. But now he's turned back around again. I think some of those shots that were hitting me there was friendly fire coming at me from behind. Oh! That was a friendly it got in the way. I, I've got a little choice now. If I can finish this one off, I'm then leaving. He was trying to ram me there. He's been destroyed and I am getting the hell out of here. Hopefully Coney Port will let me dock. Gerard Nationalists and who was I fighting before? Gerard Nationalists, okay. What's that done for my combat rating? Bugger all. Mind you, I haven't claimed any of my combat bombs, so maybe that's why. Okay, let's uh, get out of here. So I've uh, made 3,000 times 8. That's what, 24,000, but I will have lost far more than that in damage repairs and uh, uh, rearming on it. I did not use a lot of my cannon uh, shots. So again, you could say that uh, my time in the conflict zone was finished by being rammed. The thing is, it was a friendly, 
who sort of tried to barge me out of the way. Go twenty four thousand in uh, bonds for uh, combat. I don't think that's going to do. I don't think it's going to change my uh, rating. Bring in my like to do at least uh, like twenty, or get at least twenty kills just to get my uh, rating up from uh, harmless to mostly harmless. So. I somehow doubt that another eight on top of the few that I've already got since uh, that rating change is really going to uh, make any difference but it does all go towards it so I mean it will make a difference in one way just not an immediate one landing gear deployed but I think I may find myself staying here for a while. So if anybody is on my private group, Jesus fucking Christ! Yeah, I've lost out big time there. And then of course there's me wear and tear. That's okay. That's all right. So after paying all that out. I then click on the wrong fucking thing. Anyway, as I was saying, yes, if there's anybody on my private group who wants to come to Jera, uh, then come along and um, we'll see if we can uh, do some more damage um, than what I already have. I may need to experiment with different weapon loadouts. <laughs> um, now, while I'm here, let's, let's do what I was supposed to do. Combat bond, 24,000. There you go, so I only lost about 75,000 in that one. Big deal. My balance was over three million. It certainly fucking ain't now. Anyway, while I'm here, let's take a look at what I can do for my. Uh, what have they got? I am becoming a bit reliant on um, gimbaled uh, weapons, so I don't really want to use fixed mounted stuff. Which means that even if they had it, which they don't. I wouldn't get the plasma accelerator. I haven't really got a great deal here in terms of uh, weapons. Probably not surprising given how much uh, um, you know the fact that there's a war going on. I don't think they've got anything that's going to fit my ship. They've got an A5. That's no good to me. Well, it would be good to me, but I can't fucking afford it. Frame shift drive, I can only get an A. Shield generator, I can only get the A. So, yeah. I'm a bit fucked at the moment. In terms of upgrades, I'm basically stuck with what I have. Still, there you go. Um, Yeah, he's not, uh... This is just about, um... Well, just regular stuff. There's nothing here about the actual Zera, uh, war. So there we go, fighting on the side of the Zera nationalists. I've, um... Well, not done a great deal, to be honest. But 
Purple Holding Purple Fortune is Empire, Zero Holdings is Empire. Social Democrats and the Nationalists, who are the two who are fighting, I think, are um well there's no mention of whether they are Imperial or not. In fact it says they're independent for both. So I've no idea if I've been fighting on the behalf of the uh, Empire or not there. Which is annoying. So, anyway, there we go. I've got eight kills in that one. And not a whole lot else. So, right, well, there you are. So there's a, a bit of combat for you. So, um... Yeah, head to Jera for uh, some uh, battle action. There you go, that brings this video to an end. So uh, this is Commander Lucosa signing off.